Hello and welcome to the session. In this session I will discuss a question which says that from the top of a 7 meters high building, the angle of elevation of the top of the tower is 60 degrees and the angle of depression of the foot of the tower is 30 degrees. Find the height of the tower. Now before starting the solution of this question, we should know some results. First is, in triangle ABC, tan theta is equal to perpendicular over base which is equal to AB over BC as the perpendicular here is AB and base here is BC. And second is the angle of elevation. Now suppose a person is standing at a point A and he is observing an object which is at the point C. Then in this case AC will become the line of sight. Now the angle formed between the line of sight and the horizontal that is this angle which is angle BKC is called the angle of elevation. So here angle of elevation is angle BAC. And third is the angle of depression. Now in this case suppose a person is standing on the top of the tower AB that is at point A and he is viewing an object which is lying at the point C then in this case AC will be the line of sight and the angle which is formed between the line of sight and the horizontal that is this angle is called the angle of depression. So here angle of depression is angle DAC. So the angle of depression is formed whenever the object is lying below the horizontal level that is the case when we lower our head to look at the point being viewed. Now these results will work out as a key idea for solving out this question. Now we will start with the solution. Now let AB be the building and CE be the tar. Now it is given that from the top of the 7 meters high building, the angle of elevation of the top of the tower is 60 degrees and angle of depression of the foot of the tower is 30 degrees. Now using this result, which is given in the key idea, from the top of the building, the angle of elevation of the top of the tower is equal to 60 degrees. So we have angle EAD is equal to 60 degrees. Now using this result which is given in the key idea, from the top of the building the angle of depression of the foot of the tower is 30 degrees. So we have angle DAC is equal to 30 degrees. Now from the diagram AD is parallel to BC. Therefore, angle CAD is equal to angle ACP as these are interior alternate angles. So this implies angle ACB is equal to 30 degrees that is this angle is equal to 30 degrees. Now using this result which is given in the key idea in triangle ABC tan 30 degrees is equal to AB over BC which is perpendicular over base. Now this implies 
tan 30 degrees, which is 1 by root 3, is equal to AB, which is 7 over BC, which further implies BC is equal to 7 root 3 meters. Now, from the diagram, AD is equal to BC, therefore, AD is also 7 root 3 meters. Now, in triangle ATE, tan 60 degrees is equal to ED over AD. Now, this implies tan 60 degrees is root 3 is equal to ED over AD and AD is 7 root 3 meters so it will be 7 root 3 which implies ED is equal to 7 root 3 into root 3 meters which is equal to 7 into 3 meters which is equal to 21 meters. So we have ED is equal to 21 meters. Also, from the diagram, AB is equal to CD is equal to 7 meters. So here, CD is equal to 7 meters. Now, EC is equal to ED plus DC. As you can see from the diagram, EC is equal to ED plus DC. Now this is equal to ED is equal to 21 meters plus DC is equal to 7 meters which is equal to 28 meters. Now we have taken CB as the tar hence height of the tar that is EC or CE is equal to 28 meters. So this is the solution of the given question and that's all for the session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.